Hey, what's up? Welcome back to South 10 Beer Reviews. I'm Tyler. Thanks for stopping by. If you're new to the channel, consider hitting that subscribe button. We'd definitely appreciate it. Tonight, we got another beer review, and this is going to be another one from New Glarus. And this is going to be, uh, it's a Belgian Red. I don't know. There we go. Yeah, Belgian Red, um, Wisconsin Belgian Red. And I think that's just the name of it. Yeah, so it's brewed in Wisconsin. Um, picked this up while I was in Green Bay. And um, man, it's got a huge um, description on here. I'm not going to read all that. Um, but it does say Belgian roasted barley. Oh, see here. Uh, this is L is brewed with whole monitor. I can't even read the word. It's so small. Anyway, it's got cherries, uh, farmed wheat, and Belgium roasted barleys, uh, balanced by hops. We aged in our brewery for one full year, and then aged in oak vats. Kind of odd. Because um, I'm assuming they're saying they aged the hops, which I don't, I don't maybe that's a thing. Um, over a pound of Door County cherries in every bottle. So Door County is in uh, Wisconsin. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this in the glass. I've heard a lot of good things about the new Glarus. Uh, fruited beers. So let's go ahead and check it out. All right. So as far as the appearance, yeah, it's kind of a um, just a. It's like a deep. It looks a little darker on camera, but it's like a deep ruby red. Uh, it's got a nice haze to it. Uh, maybe more of a chill haze. I can't really tell uh, exactly. There is a little bit of clarity near the bottom of the glass, but um, it's kind of an off-white head. Uh, it's dissipating fairly quickly, which is usually pretty common with the sour beers. So um, let's go ahead and get a nose on it. See how it smells. Ooh, okay. Man, that smells good. Yeah, it smells uh, obviously like cherry. Um, it's got a, I don't know, it's got a jamminess to it. Um, think of like, I don't know, cherry jam. Oh, it's very, it smells really nice. It's got a really nice sweet uh, type of aroma to it. I'm getting a little bit of like a Belgian type of yeast under there. Smells really good. It's kind of reminding me a little bit of like one of the Creek, I think is what they say, Creek Lambics. Um, it's not quite to that like funk level uh, like a Lambic has in my opinion, but it's the cherry is coming across in uh, a familiar way. It smells really good though. Let's go ahead and try it. Cheers. Oh man, dude, that is that is good. That is really good. Does this have an ABV on this bottle here? Don't see it anywhere. Yeah, I don't know what the ABV is on this, but it's really freaking tasty, dude. Like huge, huge amounts of sweet cherry. Still got that cherry jamminess. Really sweet though. Nice little bit of tartness in there too. It's not overly sour, but it's it's got a decent amount of tartness in there. Nice kind of lighter side of medium on the body. Like it's not super thin. It's also got a little more acidity to it than I was expecting it to have. Man, that is really good. That cherry just drives from the front of the palate all the way through. It just lingers there before it dries out. It's got a nice like sweetness that just rides, it just lingers. This is really enjoyable. Like I could see this being something like almost a, like an after dinner, or actually I could see this being something I would drink with like. I don't know, a steak or something like that. It 
decent carbonation to it. Nothing overwhelming. It's not like super, you know, spritzy on the on the tongue or anything like that. Um, this is a really, really well done um, Belgian type of sour. Um, really, really happy with this. I'm glad I picked it up. I'm trying to think really if there's much more to talk about. I mean, as far as ABV, which I don't know what it is, it's not on the bottle. I would guess somewhere around six if I had to guess. Mm. Every sip, I'm just like, dang, it's freaking tasty, dude. I need to try some more um, New Belgium uh, fruited stuff. Did I just say New Belgium? New Glarus, sorry. I wonder how many times I've said New Belgium in this video. Um, New Glarus, New Glarus, New Glarus, out of Wisconsin. Um, uh, yeah, it, it's just jammy cherries, and it's got a little bit of like a, a Belgian type of uh, yeast profile to it, but it's, it's just... It's just a pleasure to drink. There's no nothing off-putting about it. It's not overly sweet. It's not overly sour. There's no bitterness to speak of. Uh, you know, you do get a little bit of the of the oak, I think. It's just got a little bit of like a woody type of character on the very back end. I don't know. It's really enjoyable. I don't know what else to say about it. I keep keep I keep saying the same things. So. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and rate it, and I'm going to give this a solid 4.5. I think this is really good, man. Like, if you get the chance to try this, uh, do it. Do yourself a favor. Don't pass up on it, especially if you like a sour beer um, or cherry uh, in that regard. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and a comment, and let me know what you think. Let me know what you're drinking on this evening. And if you like what I'm doing, hit that subscribe button. We'll see you guys in the next video. Cheers.